Hey there, my friends. How you doing? Uh, I'm here to share uh, my last set of mock toe boots, uh, my Red Wing mock toe boots. And uh, let's do let's do something fun. This is what we used to do back uh, in my day when I was a kid and we played hide and seek. A lot of outdoor stuff. Remember? No one goes outside anymore. But uh, anyways, everybody would put their uh, their toe in. So in this case, this would be, this would be too, uh, I wonder if you guys remember this. This is from California now. I don't know. I don't know about uh, the East Coast ring, but so now we're trying to figure out who the person's going to be it. The one that counts, you know, and seeks. Everybody was hiding. So this is to be the person that has to count. And you don't want to be that person. But anyways, that's, so anyways, we used to do this. Everybody's got their everybody's got their toes in, facing each other. We go eeny, meeny, miny, mo. Catch a tiger by his toe. If he hollers, let him go. My mother says that you are not it. Okay, so this person would be able. He's out. He'd be able to go hide. And uh, this person would be the seeker. I thought I would just share that with you for some fun. That's how we saw. And then, of course, uh, in baseball, when we played baseball, you'd throw a bat up, catch it around the, um, the handle, where you you know, and then you'd go here, 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 and the person that could top it off would uh, be able to call if they were up first or they wanted to be up last, whatever. Okay, enough on that old history stuff. So, anyways, uh, let's just let's go with um, let's go with these guys here, okay? Now these are my um, these are my Red Wing uh, Black Prairie Black Prairie, and these are really my work boots. These are really my work boots. Um, don't let this fool you here. The this is the white, um, you know, whatever they call it, the white uh, tread. What I did was I. What I did was I kind of cheated because I need every I need black shoes all the way around at work, so I just took some kiwi uh, shoe polish and did the sides all the way around on my. And when they get resold, I will have them done black. I will have them done black. But um, anyways, you can see uh, you could really see sometimes I, I know you can't do now, but you can see that the. Uh, the brown side there. Oh, uh, see the brown? See, it's really brown, and then they, they just um, paint it or whatever, uh, stain it or whatever, all black. And so when that starts to fade a little bit, uh, the brown kind of comes through. And, it's, and uh, so it. one day these are going to look super cool. Really, really cool. So this is, in case you're... Uh, wondering what number of boot these are red wing uh works with numbers by the way my friends uh this one's a 9.5 uh d and the model number is um 8849 and these were made in uh august of 21 august of 21 and uh, I love them. Oh, I, I was trying to share with you that this is my work boot. Um, I'm in these, uh, oh, oh, probably eight, eight to 10 hours a day, you know, five days a week. And this is what I wear to work. And man, I'm telling you what, when I get home, uh, sometimes I just, I even forget to take them off sometimes. Because it's they're not anything like oh man when I when I get home I gotta I gotta kick these dogs off you know these things are killing me so it's not like that at all man these things and they're only getting better is the amazing thing about it they're only getting better by the day by by each wear they're more and more and more comfortable and it's wild because they're sturdy they're really sturdy I mean you know they're really sturdy they protect your foot well. Um, and, uh, and yet they're like, uh, they're like a, uh, just a very, very comfortable, snug, uh, slipper, almost like it's weird. But, um, so these are my black, these are my black, uh, 
Red Wing, uh, Black Prairie Red Wing Mock Toes. And like I said, I kind of cheated on the, um, the tread here uh, with the coloring, but uh, that's required at work as a, an all black shoe or boot. So, um, and, and plus, and plus I, when these do need to be uh, redone, I am gonna do these in a, in a black Vibram. Okay, so that's these guys, okay? That's these guys, thank you. And then my friends, uh, I have the good old ones that everybody wants out of all the colors, five, six, seven colors, whatever. Uh, man, uh, this was shortly after COVID. I got these and uh, I guess production was down or whatever. And man, I had to wait. I had to wait uh, through, through the, my Red Wing store, my local store where I live. I had to... Uh, Oh, shoot, it was probably pretty much amazing. I think they had them back, they had them to me, uh, gave me a call within two months. Yeah, which isn't too bad, actually, really, uh, considering the situation at that time. But these are them, and uh, where's my, what did I do with my brush? Oh, here it is. Here's my good old horsehair brush that, you know, does, does a fantastic job. It's uh, soft enough, it's hard enough to do the job, but soft enough to uh, just kind of um, treat the leather really. The leather, the, the leather really kind of likes it. And, um, and then like all, like all of us, you know, it's therapeutic, you know, it's kind of therapeutic to kind of do your boots. Um, I, I've used, I've oiled uh, these, I, I oiled these um, once, once when I got them um, with the uh, Red Wing Cream, it's white and it's, uh, um, it's neutral, neutral or natural, maybe neutral, anyways, it's, it's not supposed to darken your leather. You know, if I were to oil these things, they would be like my 8138s almost. They would just be, you know, really, really much different than they are now uh, on the darker side of things. So I don't want to do that. These are, these are my, these are my, uh, these are, oh man, I love these things. I love them all. I love them all. Um, these, now these again are her, like my other video. Um, these are tens. These are 10 Ds, and they're the 875, not the Work 10 875. These are the actual 875, which there's nothing wrong with the Work one either. It's just that they have, um, it's not nickel eyelids, and uh, what's different about them? I think there's, oh, what is different about them other than the, Oh, the, the, the color itself, the leather itself. It's a, it's a little different leather. Uh, still tough as nails, still as tough as nails, but just it just doesn't have this. Um, this is the one that they, uh, you know, save for these and stuff. So that's my, um, my last of my mock toes. I have four. These are uh, the last of them here, and I just got to share these with you. Anybody that's torn between the 811, this is my Red Wing. Um, geez, I forgot now, I don't even wear them anymore. I'm wearing my mocks at the time. Uh, leather laces on these ones, leather laces. I oiled them and they seem to be um, hanging in there. They don't, they don't snap or break on me. I kind of just ran some oil through them and let them dry. And these are my, oh, 8085s. You guys know that. 8085s in the copper rough and tough copper rough and tough and I'm telling you what man between these and the 8111s those are really nice too but somehow somehow I like these I don't have the other one I don't have the other one the other brown one that I mentioned but um, this is my most this is my most favorite of my 
of my uh, Iron Rangers. I have four of them. I'm going to share one more with you in a minute here. But these are my, um, sorry, 8085s. And uh, when these are done, when these are done, they're far from it, but when these are done, I'm going to get the old uh, uh, cork, the uh, nitro cork, whatever. I don't care for this. I don't care for this. I'm sorry. And it's walking through the house, I have hardwood floors, and, and uh, man, you could wake up the dead with these things. I mean, they're just really, really loud. They're really loud, but they're very nice, and I love them, and